I want to talk about the difference between inline math, centered math, and aligned math. As we can see in the comments, if you put a single dollar sign around your math, it will just be inline. If you put double dollar signs around it, it will be centered. And if you're using the align environment, no dollar signs are needed for whatever happens inside there. So let me give you an example of what I mean. So I'm going to type some math. Here is an equation. So x squared plus, let's do square root y equals 3. Okay, that's just some equation that I'm typing. Here is another equation. It is very, it is very important. I will use double dollar signs. This will center it. Um, let's do integral from a to b, f of x dx. Uh, that is an integral. That's just showing what happens the rest of the sentence. And then I'll show you some aligned math later. But let's compile these to talk about the differences, to notice the differences between them. So we compiled the document, and here's how it looks. Um, I'm going to type some math. Here's an equation, x squared plus square root of y equals 3. Notice that that's just right in the middle of the sentence, and we just keep going after that. Here's another equation. It's very important. Now, in my actual code, I didn't put any sort of line break or centering or anything. I just put double dollar signs around that integral. And then I continued my sentence afterwards, but there was uh, the centering of the equation and, and a line break. If I take away these double dollar signs, watch what happens. I'm going to click Compile. I took the double dollar signs away from the integral. And watch what's going to happen to that integral. It's going to shrink and appear in the middle of the sentence, which, as you can see right there, it did. Let's um, put double dollar signs around this uh, equation, x squared plus square root y equals 3. And again, watch what's going to happen. It's going to be centered, and there's going to be a line break. So that's what single versus double dollar sign does. Single dollar sign means it just is right in the middle of what you're typing. Double dollar signs means it is centered. Um, now, for the align environment, begin, align, end, align. So suppose I want to do uh, you know, x squared plus y squared equals z squared. Okay. And I did the align environment in another lesson, so I'm not really going to go too far into the details of what this all means. But I'm just going to make up some stuff. Sine x uh, plus y. I'm, again, completely just making up some arbitrary things. Um, x plus y plus q. Right? Well, notice that um, I'm not using any dollar signs here. I'm not using any dollar signs because within the align environment, I don't need them. Square root and then a over b. Right. So none of this math inside the align environment has any um, dollar signs around it. And I'm going to typeset this. And there you can see everything is nicely lined up at the equal sign. Um, equations are all numbered, and you know all of our math displays exactly as it should display, but without any dollar signs. So uh, that's the difference between inline, centered, and aligned math. Uh, inline is single, centered is double, dollar signs, and align or the align star environment, no dollar signs needed. All right, thank you very much.